We've seen clear demand for the U.S. dollar in recent weeks, and although it hasn't been anything that really stands out, especially with the buck still reeling against some currencies, it is something to take notice of. We highlight the latest IMM data, which shows euro net longs dropping below 100,000 for the first time since June of 2020. The underlying takeaway here is that there could be room for more upside for the U.S. dollar across the board if, in fact, the bond market is proven correct about its assessment of where rates will be headed meaning higher sooner than what the Fed has been projecting. This translates to a dollar in demand on yield differentials and a dollar in demand on what could be flight to safety as investors exit long equity exposure with valuations no longer attractive. Looking ahead, some of the standouts on today's calendar include a speech from Fed Powell, U.S. existing home sales, and some more Fed speak. That's all for now.